Welcome my lovely YouTubers to my YouTube channel. Welcome back. And in this video, I'm showing you my Fall Modest Vibes look book. I'm so excited, guys. So let's go ahead and get into it. Look number one is my for my comfy girls, okay? For the girls who just wanna wear the jumpsuit, okay? So this jumpsuit is from Femi Lux, and it's actually a crop top jumpsuit, but I paired it with a black one piece underneath it. And also I paired it with a big oversized bag that my sister gave me years ago and some slides from Walmart. I thought this is just super simple for those girls who are out there running them errands, okay? Look number two, guys. Look number two is my thrifted look for the girls not out. If you're going somewhere with your girls, this is so cute. I got this army jacket thrifted and I also got this belt from American Eagle. I paired it also with this black bag I got from Macy's and I thought this look just looks so cute together. And also the black booties just kind of step it up a little bit. And I think this outfit is very cute. And shout out to those big pockets, okay? And also one thing I'll tell you, you can even do it without the belt and it still looks pretty put together. So shout out to my girls out there who are thrifters look number three Look number three is for those areas where it's really not that cold yet, but you still can be cute and put on a trench jacket. The trench coat is from Boohoo, and I just went ahead and used that same Macy's bag and crossed it over my body. I have a black one piece on and just a nice pair of jeans with those same black booties, and I think this outfit can really be cute and dressed up and dressed down. Look number four. Look number four is all about that white tee, okay? I think you cannot go wrong with a pair of white tees. So I'm getting rid of those black heels and I'm putting on these tan brown booties, okay? And I think that these brown booties will go good with this Matrasso bag. And also, I just think that white top could really be dressed up if you're going out with your girls or you're doing anything. I think this is really cute, even a church outfit. This is really cute and put together. Also, if you're really not digging that, you can always throw over a kimono on it and it can really help up your style. And you also can tie that shirt into some little knots and just really up your style and revamp it. All right, and the last but not least, my favorite one is just the normal white tee, side somewhat tucked in with a black strappy heel and a cute bag. You can't go wrong with this look, girl. So that's the white tee looks. Look number five. Look number five is for my pretty classy girls. This shirt I actually got from Kato's. And it's not a shirt, it's a blouse. So this blouse I got from Kato's and this little bag I got from Ross like years ago. And all I'm doing is pairing it with a light pink strappy heel. And I honestly think that this outfit could be really cute and simple for my girls who don't mind having their arms out. Now, if you're a girl that minds having your arms out, this kimono cover-up could be really cute for you, and it can still make you look stylish and fashionable while covering up without even looking like you're covering up. Look number six. Look number six is for my girls not out. You know, I gotta throw on some pink. So I got this pink dress from Femi Lux, and yes guys, this is a dress. So I decided not to wear it as a dress, but to wear it as a cute blouse top and pair it with just some different shades of pink. I paired it with the BB purse, and I also paired it with the same light pink nude heels. Now you could drop a black heel with this however way you want it, but I think this look was so cute and feminine. If you're going out with your girls to get some uh, late night food, if you're just gonna go have a great time with yourself take yourself on a date boo I think this would just be a really cute look look number seven Look number seven is all about the black dress, guys. This black dress I actually got thrifted and it's kind of small on the arm, so I just kind of pulled them up. And I paired it with the light pink purse from BB and just some simple black strappy heels. I thought this looked super good and super simple. However, for me, it's just a little bit too much. I don't think I would feel comfortable just wearing this by itself in public. So I paired it with this light pink blazer, actually the hot pink blazer I got from Boohoo. So I thought this would be helping you look like a businesswoman you're going to go out there and make some boss moves, faith moves, okay? So shout out to those dance moves. But yeah, that's just how I thought I would pair this outfit and make it look really, really good together. Look number eight, guys. This look right here, I absolutely love. It is a actual dress from Femi Lux, but the thing about it is I have a one piece with it. So I feel like this right here, I made it into a skirt and just kind of tied it, and it looked really cute. And I say, if you're going on a date with your man, ladies, if you're just gonna go do some things for yourself, I think this right here is really cute, especially for all my married women out there. Like, go ahead, take, 
get cute, feel good about yourself, boo. Put on something new and go out there with your husband. Have a great time. Look number nine, guys. Look number nine is all about the businesswoman. This is my favorite look. It's that same skirt, but however, I made it into the dress part of it. And the dress is a one shoulder. And so I went ahead and paired it with this over top beige over top that I got from Kato's with the BB purse and some nude heels from Rue 21. I felt like this embodied businesswoman vibes for me, faith moves vibes for me. And so guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you liked it. I hope you like my dance move. Make sure you like and you subscribe and I'll see you in our next one. Hey guys, before you go, make sure you go ahead and subscribe and join the YouTube family and watch my other video content.